Okay guys, this is Renorello TV. I'm at Plum Beach. I'm gonna show you a few tips. A lot of people doesn't fish here, but uh, this fish here, they just don't know. Okay, this is the parking lot. Okay, right here. This is the parking lot. And this is the building you look for the turn that you heard in Plum Beach. I'm gonna take you on the beach now, okay? Alrighty. So, call my subscriber. I uh, thank you. And for those who like to view my channel, I would like for you to subscribe. I got many more to come. And I got not only fishing videos, I got cycling videos also to come. So you can watch me. Click on that bell and subscribe for Winnerello TV. Okay, this is Plum Beach people. Okay, this is what it look like. This, this spot is good for taking your kids and if they love fishing and teach them to cast because it's not it's not a loaded beach when it comes to people so it's very spacious tide is coming in now still low doesn't reach big yet but uh this is what they call Plum beach okay and this is where you can catch striped bass right along here and bluefish i'm gonna take you down here a little bit i'm gonna take you it's, it's not that sandy bottom out here it's a lot of mud especially down that side it's good for plunder and fluke a lot of bait comes in here because that's that's the that's the marine, um, sheep said marine boat, boat yard down there. So a lot of baits run through this channel here. And it brings a lot of bluefish in the springtime and in the summertime also. So I can smell that mud. So this is Club Beach. I'm gonna go take you up the beach. See, a few people come with their dog. Okay, so I'm gonna take you up to Plum Beach. Up the beach should say. This is all Plum Beach. Not a lot of baiters. People mostly sun sun bath here. So the water ain't that ain't that clean in, in this part of it. Okay, so I'm gonna walk you all the way up the beach and show you a few tips. Yeah. <laughs> dangerous you know you could find space to walk yeah you go on the point and you cast straight ahead you hit that that striped bass and you hit that blue fish also it's not good for focus it's, it's a lot of seaweed it's a lot of seaweed at the bottom so as soon as the, the, the sink comes down tide high it comes all the way to this grassy here especially on the full moon tide okay this is the other side of Plum Beach I'm gonna walk you up I'm gonna walk you up but I'm gonna have to cut because it's a it's a, it's a nice little walk but let me show you something else 
and the high tide you can cast the beach the bass comes here okay so I'm gonna cut and I will catch you up when I reach the next spot okay guys welcome back to my channel I've just reached the spot this is still Plum Beach just the first overpass right there and this is all Plum Beach the other side of Plum Beach okay that's the boat yard over there okay I'm gonna tell you something a little secret okay right where I'm standing look I'll show you see this is, is the meditation over there okay. right where I'm standing right here it's a pogey spot sea bass and pogey and you hit the blackfish there too it got a lot of muscle muscle bed over there and you sometimes yeah you get a little hitchy as i said muscle bed but it carries nice pogies blackfish and sea bass i catch some of my biggest sea bass right here so from right where i'm at i'm showing you pointing you I'm gonna show you up the beach. Okay, I'm gonna walk and show you where the pogies spot and where you stop. It's also a striped bass. This is my spot for big striped bass. See? When the tide high, you can't fish here because all this is flooded. Okay, so you stop right here. This is all the pogie spot from where I will show you down here. Come all the way up to right here. You get a lot of pogies right here. And the striped bass now. The best time to fish here for stripers is nighttime. Yeah, late evening, nighttime. I hit some of the biggest basses that I have catched right here. Right here. And I'm going to show you. See that corner? Don't go around the corner. It's bad back here. Because it's it's a deep drop off this is a channel for the boaters you stay on the straight if you go around the corner you're gonna have problems it's muddy out there it's muddy so it's a good spot for flander a lot of flanders out there but people don't know that okay so you don't go around the corner you stop at the corner for stripers at night time cast straight ahead to the boat yard with bunkers you don't surf, surf here because surfing is not good here it's deep out there and it's the stripers the big cold stripers they down there especially in the springtime may june this is where you come for striped bass low tide because you can't come here and high tide all of this is flooded all these sandbanks right here and high tide is flooded. You can't fish here. You only can fish here on low tide. And if the tide is coming, coming in, you could only fish for a certain amount of time before you have to back off. So all of this, all of this is gonna be flooded in the next three hours, two and a half hours. Okay, so this is the spot. Stripers. And I'm gonna take you up. Okay, we're coming to the corner. See that buoy there? You can, if you're experienced and know how to climb, you sink up the bank, you will fish here. But it's a, a lot of flanders. A lot of flanders here. It's muddy out here. It's muddy. So you stop here. Stripers, boat yard over there. Cast to boat yard with bunkers or herring or you know whatever bait I just see a splash out here too yeah yeah so you stay away from stay away from here it's hard to fish from here for Flanders you could stay right here it's, it's a lot of mud it's all mud going out then it goes down you don't know the fish here is gonna be not just all of these all that what you're looking at right there it's gonna all be flooded 
because the tide is coming in now so all of that gonna be flooded next two hours from now okay so that's it folks this is the tips don't come around here there's pokey back there but it's hard to fish because you're coming up the mountain and it's loaded with muscle bed you must get stuck okay so that's the tip i got for you so this is plum beach one of the spots that a lot of people don't know about big bass but you have to have faith okay alrighty so folks this is it you can subscribe to my channel and uh, I see you in my next video hopefully I'll be doing some striped bass fishing or a cycling video okay alright folks see you in the next one